Hello friends, welcome back. Yet another session with the prompt engineering. This time it's going to be more interesting. Create for prompt engineering. C R E A T E. -E. C for character. You are free to define the role for the chat GPT or any search engine. Here I have shown you an example. Can you act as my English coach? Yes, it does. And I am throwing a question with a lot of mistakes there. Children are playing outside on rain. Can you check this sentence for mistakes is the question I am asking and it is acting as my English coach and it has corrected the mistake. Children should be children, on rain should be in the rain and this is how it plays a role of a coach. So, C for character and you are free to define the character. What next? The next one is going to be very interesting too. It is a request, R for request. Your request has to be very clear and concise. It has to be very specific. For an instance, here you are throwing a request to it, compose an email to invite people for annual day function. This is a very clumsy request. Instead, I am throwing a question, I am throwing a request in a much more clearer way. Compose an email for the 13th annual day which is scheduled to happen during December 25th, 2023. Also mention the dress code for the participants as formals for adults, casuals for kids. Parking details have to be specified, car zone 1, two wheelers zone 2. So now it is composing a detailed email because I have requested it to do so but I have provided all the necessary information and all of them are captured nicely in the reply that it is giving. So R for a request and that's very interesting too. Now C R is an E. E for example. Very simple you should provide a lot of good examples for it to really provide you good reply and responses meaningfully. So I have given an instance here which you can see. We have to add 130 plus 125 plus 191 and 1 finally. First, you should add 130 plus 125, it will get you 255. Then you should add 255 plus 191, it will get you 446. Finally, you should add 1 with 446, which will get you 447. Now, I have made the same statement in a non-detailed way in the previous attempt I made. So, it was confused. It was not able to give me a bright reply, correct reply. Now, since I broke it down properly, the example was very detailed and proper. It was able to understand and then it will give me proper reasoning. The next question we may throw in the same way. It will be able to perform in a nice way and that's how it works. Now, A. Adjustments. Adjustments are very important. You should be able to tune your uh, prompt properly and adjust your prompt properly. Give me crisp details about Indian freedom struggle. So, it has given me some very crispy points about Indian freedom struggle. Now, I am tuning it a little bit. I want only 5 points, bulleted, short and sweet. So, it has given me 5 points. Now, next level, I am going to give only one request, which is going to be, I want only one point on the freedom struggle. Give me that, please. So, more you adjust it, more you tweak it, you will get answers in the way you want. So, adjustments are very, very important as well. Try it out and that's going to be very interesting. T. Tell the type of output that you want. Produce a 500 word poem on the Indian freedom struggle. So, I made it very clear. I need 500 words. I need a poem. So, it has given me the poem very nicely and it's a 500 word poem. So, you have to tell the system very clearly as in what is the expectation. So, that's what T means. If you want to E for extras, that's the final one. You've got a bunch of paragraphs which are fed in into the chat GPT and you want it to summarize. You can summarize. You can even say that ignore all my previous inputs. And you should ask me as many as questions. If you say that, it will keep on asking you more questions. And you can even prompt it like this. Don't consider the 2023 data. And you can even say this way. Use uppercase letters for all important points. So, these are all the extras that you can really fetch out of chat GPT prompting. I hope it was useful. Try it out. And in case you have questions, you can always reach me. I will be glad to help you. Thank you.